really be able to tell you the right. stats on that. However, Hank had no idea. Well, I guess I shouldn't say that. We saw him jumping in reaction. Who knows? Nice backhand there from Come Hank. On. Nice return. Love one. It's going to be a war. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Love That's all the shots these. there. All right, the boys are the boys are dancing here. And Come we on, are baby. underway. Come on, baby. Love three. Love three. Hangs up three zip right now. He's returning the serve to Jake Marsh very well. Jake Marsh oh. with the forehand. Hank can't return it. One, three, three to one in favor of Hank. Held from the net. Hank oh, with the forehand. How you that. doing? And Hank. I missed that shot too. Returned that like it was a size too small. One four. It's <laughs> a good one, Spider. <laughs> uh, five one. Yeah. Hank oh with the nice God, serve. Just missing on the serves there. Henry There's the gone. first O Henry. Five to two. No. It's probably going right. back and forth. Hank's a little bit in his own head. Very uh, reminiscing of the okay. MRAGs here. And what do you think so far, MRAGs? Is this how you expected oh. it to go? Or I, I'll be very honest. Jake has a very impressive forehand. I knew Five he was four. very talented. I'm very impressed by the power that Jake Marsh is showing right now. Even though he's not up. Like right there. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Jake Marsh, oh, great yeah, forehand. Yeah. wonder if the Five lefty five. messes up anyone. You <sighs> typically don't play against lefties. Um, and Jake's obviously a very talented player. And nodded here at five, so it should be interesting. Five, six. Jake's serve. Come on, Henry. Hank six, can't six. return it. Another Henry count. Hank, nice little volley going here, playing the short side. Wow. Forehand from Jake. Back in from Jake. Come forehand on, Henry. from Henry. Really taking advantage the of the six, full seven. table. Wow. Very nice. That's what the people want. Six, Jake, eight. a little unforced error. Nice forehand there from Hank. Well, back in action. Nine six. Yeah. Nine six. Back to Hank. Wow, Spider, what are you seeing here so far? Who are you liking? You here? know, I think I think uh, Hank came out to a great start. As we saw the tower topple, Jake could have been seven. a little uh, slow, sluggish, a little distracted on the game ahead of him. And uh, Hank seems to have answered the call Nine, at least eight. early. The question is, yeah. is whether Commissioner Hank will have the legs to do it. And I'm just going to shout out Hogecoin before I turn the mic over. Hogecoin has, Thanks Hoge Coin has the in. craziest Twitter of all time. Let me just say that. All right, we got Mintz joining me in the booth here. 10-8. Ten, ten oh, ten eight. Eight. It's 10-8. Hank is in the lead right now. And these, and these guys have oh. good volleys. Hank gets a little bit of help from the net there. 11-8. Favorite of Hank. Mincy, welcome, welcome. How man, are you? Doing good, man. Anytime these two guys match up, it's must-see TV. And I, I looked up uh, and saw that I started it's panicked. Like I don't want to miss any of this, <laughs> man. It's must-see action. Anytime Hank and Jake match up, uh, I think it may be the best rival we have right now in Stool Stream Stadium. And, you know, Hank, Hank has beaten him before. Uh, I think it's just so important with Jake. It, no. It's all about Hank winning game one. Right. So important to win that first game. Right. And who's your pick here in this I got Jake 2-1. to one. You got Jake 2-1. to one. I have oh, Hank. Oh, no! What I have Hank 2-1. to one. I do think Hank takes this one home. He rode with me, you know, even though it was the most incorrect pick in the history of incorrect oh picks. My God, but I'm playing a little favoritism Absolutely there. Choking. Henry getting Henry. a little bit into his well, own I'm head. Vision. I'm not sure if you saw the tip that happened <sighs> minutes before the battle, but a uh, table collapsed oh. due to Jake Marsh's phone. Oh, really? And there was a big Four time one. spill uh, in the Triple S studio. Oh, wow. Okay. And did that affect, uh, you think, anybody's mindset here? I think Five it one. affected Jake a little bit because he came off a little oh, bit slow. But it? now it looks like uh, it, roles are kind of reversing here. Hank's a little bit in his own Five head. Two. Here, deep breaths going down. No. Jake's returning nice serves. And Hank's Five just three. missing the table by about three to four inches. Yeah, Hank is uh, an intense mental guy. And it, when he, Hank gets his forehand going, he's unstoppable. But, you know, if he has, Price. when momentum goes the wrong way, I feel like he, he's, he's liable to snowball oh, yeah. sometimes. Oh, yeah. And like you said, this rivalry goes back for a while. So this is awesome to see live. I mean, just the speed at these balls are just impressive to see. Oh, yeah. And Jake's just such a tough competitor. He's like one of those guys. He seems like an emotionless killer. But he, yeah. he's he, – he, 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 you see it right now with his forehand. Come on! Wow. What oh, wow. What a point there. Hank what a volley. Alive. What a Hank volley. Hank keeping that alive. Took Jake had out three. The last night. Jake had three aggressive – 14, 18. Oh, we're going to get a replay We're going to get a replay on this one. Right Jake had three aggressive see that again. What a rally. Hank's returning with the backhand. Nice backhands from Hank. Just staying alive. Putting a little bit of spin on it. Help from the table. And then Jake Marsh, 14, the Force error, a little bit long. We got Hank winning right now, 18-14. So important for Hank to close out this 15, first game. Because yeah. you know Jake's gonna, not going to ever go down without a fight. Yeah. So it's nice. imperative help, to win the game. Help from the net there. Henry's feeling good right now. <laughs> Sickening. 15-19. Jake with the raw laugh, but... You know, he's dying inside. This is oh, unbelievable. Yeah. Oh, point. 
Game Jake, Jake here. looking a little flustered. Hank's, Hank's feeling good right now. Hank, five game points here to close the all-important game one. Exactly. Great serve there Great, from yeah. Jake. Great it's power right over the net. That's what you want to say. Aggressive serve there by Jake, yes. What? 16 well, We're going to redo that one. Four game points here still for Mr. Lockwood. Wow. Oh, three now. Great forehand from Jake. That's what I'm talking finish, about. Finish, finish, finish. 17-20. I'm sure being a lefty, I was mentioning this to Spider, has to just trip people up a little bit. Wow. Finally. Gets Jake a stays alive with a little help. Only, two, only needs two more. Save three game points. Oh, oh and he misses and he the short long. forehand. Oh, my God. And there's Jake some emotion Moore from showing Jake. emotion. Oh, we're gonna get a replay, Jake. Jake, you know, whoo! Jake doesn't freak out often. We gotta no. go back and watch this replay. Look at this energy. Look at the passion from the stool streams ping pong lounge. Wow! Look at that. Look, I would have been angry if I were Jake wow. too. He saves three match points to wow. cut it to 2018, and Hank had a bad return, a short ball to Jake's forehand, which is usually a strength. Uh, that's one. I mean, I would have been frustrated too. I mean, he feels like he missed a golden opportunity there to make it only be one game point. And we got another. Like, we got another replay. replay to Jake showing frustration, yelling stupid. I mean, look at this overhead angle of Jake. Look at that. The tongue out. The like scream. Gone. Just the agony of defeat in Stoolstream Stadium, and especially to Hank when they have such a rivalry built up. Right. You know, Jake. And Jake can downplay it and do the aw shucks as much as he wants. You know, he hates losing to Mr. Lockwood. And now Hank Here's with you. momentum going into game two. I mean, Jake's bringing that fire now. I was wondering oh, how man. he was going to come off. You just sense the sense of nice urgency move. immediately for right. Jake here Boy. in game two. I mean, he's moving. He's grooving. He's looking good. Nice forehand. Hanky come on. Oh, wow. Come on. When every tennis player starts saying come on, you know it's serious. No. Wow. Real curious to see how the start of this guy goes because you can just see Jake. Jake up three. Jake. Timeout. Time time out. Out. We got a time timeout out. on the field. Jake is fired up right now. This is uh you know this is what basketball coaches do. A little team goes on a run. They get heated up. The uh, arena gets a little bit too loud. You call a timeout. You crack open a high noon. You let the nerves settle in. Let Jake you know kind of bring down a little bit. And Hank is uh, gathering himself right here and he's looking to bounce back. Right I like I like the strategic decision by Lockwood. Jake came out and you could just sense that he means he means freaking business here in game two. He's upset with. The opportunity blew at the end of game wow. one. He's I mean, coming out. This is this is like vintage Jake Martian. You know, Jake, a guy that doesn't show a ton of emotion, you know, maybe getting like fired up like this is good for him. I mean, wow. He just looks and so, so focused and out for Jake. And you always wonder, you know, em emotions happen differently for people. So sometimes people scream and yell and then they play worse. It's making Jake play better. As I say yeah. that, there, there's the MRAG's motion. Uh, Hank gets his first point of game two. I'm just All Jake here, 6-1 oh, early. I didn't take the switch off. We're getting a sweatshirt takeoff from Hank here. So, Mincy, what do you uh, what do you see here? Obviously, Hank had that first game, right? Yeah, I thought, like I said, for to beat Jake, Hank had to win game one because yep. Jake Morris ain't going down without a fight. Six, one. There's no no getting around that. And here he goes. Uh, the thing with playing Jake that's so tough is he's able to cover wow. 90% of the table with his forehand. Wow, yeah, that's insane. I mean, he, you just get like, you know, you try to attack Jake's nice backhand, forehand. but it's so hard to get there because he's got oh. such long arms. Wow. Great, great rally. We're having there. some great rallies here. 7-1. Jake Marsh, six-point lead here. Great rally. Hank, unforced error, wasn't able to return Eight the serve. 8-1 to H Jake Hank Marsh. generally tries to get aggressive on Jake's serve because, Jake, that's that's one that's one of the only things you really can attack. 2-8. Two 2-8. Eight. Two eight. Hank knows he's in a little bit of a hole here. No, nope, Jake. That goes it. long. 3-8. Key, key stretch here for Jake, for Hank. He's gonna ah, there we go. And there Lockwood, we go. we've seen that forehand winner yep. so many Four times. That's three in a row. That's that, three forehand, in a row. that forehand is his strong side. Wow, look at the movement from Jake. Great shot there by Hank, though. Five Hank, eight. four in a row. Wow. All right, Hank fighting back in it. And now Jake Marsh is the energy a little bit depleted after all of that kind of hype. And as I say that, spikes it right back with Hold the on. forehand. Jake's forehand is a terror. I think we're getting the sweatshirt back on here. I mean, in my time, I've watched a lot of Jake. Fixing Jack the mic. Yeah, we're fixing it. I've watched Jake play tons now. And the only way to play, you got to get Nine him sets. on the defensive, but it's so hard to do. you got to just attack. Yep. Because if you let Jake hey, take points, you're not winning. And you can't Ten be six. giving up any points, obviously. We know that. Hank gives one up there. The margin for error. A little bit off the thin. edge. Hank showing some frustration. Did do a good job fighting back in it. But Jake six. now winning a couple points in a row. Wow. 11 seven. Jake just kind of let that one go. Just misses the Hank. table. Hank, like Hank gotta give Hank credit though. Jake came out dominating wow. here. Now this is 11-8. This is still certainly a game here in game two. 
Yeah, it's, it's definitely 11 8. Wow. Oh, I needed the bounce. That forehand power of Jake Marsh is just looking good right there. 8 12. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, that's what it is when you play Jake. He's, he's got such an aggressive forehand. And as I said, just the way he can cover wow. the table. Man, Hank there. Hank's Monster in the forehander. zone. Hank's in the zone. 9 12. Jake. Whoa. Whoa. That was That almost looked malicious. A little headhunting going on. Whoa, possibly. Whoa, it's 10 12. Mm -hmm. 10 12, yes. 10 12. 10 12. 10 12. Jake in the lead right now. Ooh. Hank making a move. Oh, oh, he misses the table. Jake Marsh. Frustrating That's one there point. for Hank. Here we go. Uh, Hank did such a good job oh, getting those other two balls back. Wow. That's the one I can't hit to him. Oh, four. I mean, Jake is like, I'm looking at his face in between points. It is just oh. pure intensity. Man. Jake, Jake is fired up for this. Look, Jake's this one of those guys, he's had so ooh. much success at Stool Stream Stadium. It's, uh, it's kind of always good to, to lose one just to re. 15-11. You see at college basketball yeah. when teams lose in the conference tournament, sometimes it right. recharges them for the tournament, you know. Absolutely. Thinking about like 12. UVA when they lost to the, the 16 seed, so came back next year and won it all. I feel like, I feel like Jake uh, 15, 13. feels super motivated, but still anybody's game here. Hank won a few points in a row. Wow, Ooh, great forehand. Great 16, forehand. 13. 16 13 in favor of Jake Marsh here. We're looking to push it to a game three. I think that's what everyone's looking for. And Hank with the dominant forehand gets a little bit of help from the net. 14 16. Look, Hank's got a shot here to sweep Jake Marsh. Nice. Forehand. Wow, what a wow. shot there. That was the anticipation. Wow. Hank caught that as it came up. Super aggressive. Classics. That was a great forehand. No. Oh, oh, unforced error there from Hank on the backhand. Five stuff. Seven. Down two points. The edges are very small here. Yep. Yeah, so wow. <laughs> that's just an easy point that Jake wishes he can get back. Six, but that's all part of the game. Great, great little rally here. Hank. Wow, just nicks the table. Oh, and Jake had saw the angle. He had the cross court. That shot open. Jake tried to just get a little cheeky it. there. Tried Seven. to get a little cheeky. 17 all. Well, Lockwood started lector. out down big. Has fought all the way back to 17 all. Seven. Trying to close Jake Marsh out. Whoa. Oh. 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 That's not what you want to see. No. Not at this point of the game. Now Jake with a one-point lead serving up 18-17. Wow. That ball clipped the line 19, there for Jake 17. Marsh. And Jake is two points away from pushing this to a game three. Wow. 2017. Jake, three match Jake points. Jake looks locked Jake in. He gave him a little wag, like a Matumbo wag. Like, not today. 2018. I got 2018 here. Dead man serve. Misses, wow. Goes Jake, long. that was almost the exact Are we going to go to overtime the here? Match to the last one, too. No! Oh, Lockwood Hank misses a short backhand to 21 19. What wow. a could, just as expected. Wow. We thought it would go three. Jake Marsh bounces back from a game one loss to. We're going to the Matum we're going to a replay with Jake. Jake showed a little flair. Wow. That a little the Kimbe. I like the him. energy I'm seeing from Jake. It's something you, you rarely see. Yeah, he, Hank pulls it out of Jake. Yeah. I, I look, Jake uh, Jake gets fired up when he plays Hank. He can still say here's our little replay. Here's Jake Marsh. Oh yeah, there it is, the Motumbo wag. We're gonna see it in a second there. Look at this. It was subtle. It was subtle. A little sneaky one. And we're going to a game three here. I mean, you would say the momentum's a little bit on Jake's side here, but Hank's putting up a fight himself. I mean, this is pretty even. I mean, it feels like a coin flip to me. You look at the scores, 21-19 yeah. and 21-18. Feels like it could go either way. Both guys so familiar with each other. I mean, this is anybody's matchup here. And, uh, you know, certainly wouldn't pet it past Mr. Lockwood. He's feeling. I feel like he's pretty confident going into the third game, even yeah. despite losing that. I mean, I that, that last game, he was down big and fought all the way back and almost won. First point goes to Jake Marsh, an unforced error by Hank right into the net. And that one's a little bit long, and we're tied up at ones. 1-1. One, one. Oh, nice little volley. A couple unforced errors here. We've seen about three, three unforced errors here. Uh, it happens. Hank needs to dodge a slow start. Oh. And the movement on these players is crisp. Nice forehand from Jake Marsh, and he is all business three, right one. now. He is all business. He's locked in. And he's ready. He's kind of pushing the tempo a little bit. Oh, too. yeah. 23. And Hank's MJ. done a great job of kind of slowing down that tempo to what he wants to play at. We've seen a couple timeouts mm -hmm. there. That was a good return there by Jake. Nice Two, depth. Four. Hitting it deep. Jake goes a little bit too long there. 3-4. Right to the net. That's just, that's just feels bad, man. 3-5. Hank got a little lazy on that serve. 4-5. 
kind of both guys feeling each other out here. It feels like a battle in game three. Jake plays with the paddle so far out in front of him. It's very impressive how much control he has over the ball. The spin rate, it's it's very no! impressive. Hank just misses. You see a little bit of frustration there. That six, brick four. wall, it definitely feels bad. And we got 6-4. Jake Marsh is in the lead. Hank, Hank showing a little, a little frustration here. He's, he should be careful. Here we go. Nice little rally oh. here. Jake Marsh a little bit long. He's missed some short forehands. You normally don't see Jake miss. Seven, five, that seems match. like the theme of game three is a little bit of unforced errors from both sides. And as you see that right there. They Hank both want this one really, yeah. really bad. This is a huge, huge Eight, rivalry. Five. Pressing a little lot, bit lot, too lot hard. A lot of pride on the line here in Still Street oh, yeah. Stadium. Nice backhands. And Hank goes a little bit too long. I nine believe five. that is 9-5 in favor of Jake Marsh. A little bit of danger zone here right for Hank. Right back into the net. Hank's yeah, taking Hank, a timeout Jake here. I it. like that call. Kind of get his composure back. I mean, we've seen him fight back before. Yeah. He fought back in, in game two, almost you know losing only 21-19 after a bad, disaster start. But it uh, feels like Jake's got a lot of momentum. Hank's made a couple unforced errors here. Start game three. Let's see if he can fight back a little bit. Spider taking a look at his microphone, I believe. Got a little mic check going on there. Spider doing his duty. Jake right moving here. around, staying uh, engaged. Doesn't want it, doesn't want his limbs to go tired. J Jake looks super dialed in, though. I mean, you just can sense how much he wants this. I don't have one in front of me. We're just getting a new mic. Getting like a new mic. But while we do off. that, uh, just want to say thanks to everybody that joined us on the Play Barstool app. You know, it's awesome to get to play for the share of $1,500. I mean, we had over 8,000 people on here. Just want to thank the Stoolies yeah. for supporting us at Stoolstream awesome. Stadium. Check, check, check. And uh, it's just amazing. To, and, you know, I, I still just can't believe how much disrespect the Stoolies have for Five, me. 5 I forgive all y'all. 5 10. <laughs> Hank looking to come back. Listen, yeah. Mincy, with such a wild card going up there, you know, you just, they, they went for it all. They went for it all. And your real supporters will benefit from it. Think about oh it that way. God. Come on, man. 5 12 now here, Hank. Uh, 5 12. If he's going to do anything, it's got to happen now. Hi. Uh, that one goes long. Jake, for Jake Marsh. Marsh. 6 12. Hank. Come on, Ooh, Hank. Oh. Showing some frustration. Lot of frustration wow. coming from Henry right here. Nice 13, little backhand. Seven. It's it's Jake's left corner. Jake a with a shot. commanding 13-7 lead here. Wow. Nice Come aggressive. On, Come on, baby. One of the 13. things Hank Hank yep. likes to get aggressive on Jake's serve. Come on, baby. Come on, nice. baby. 13-9. All right. Hank. Hank getting back into the groove here a little bit. But Come Jake on, still baby. is on phase, and that's three in a row. 13-10. 13-10. 13-10. Jake kind of letting him back in it a little bit. Come on, wow. baby. Wow. Four in a row. Come Four on, in a baby. row. 13, Hank's 11. fired up, and you know – Jake is just trying to internalize this right now. And really? Oh. And he just misses the table. Oh, and there, the goes, and there goes the high Oh, the cooler goes down. Replay, Replay incoming. Gumman. Down goes the cooler. Hank was looking for five in a row. He was about to cut it wow. to 13 to 12, and this is a short forehand. And I, wow. I can't blame him for the frustration. Wow. I mean, that's just passion. That's just passion. That's oh. energy. Welcome to Stool Streams. My goodness. My goodness, that see. poor cooler. We're waiting for Spider just to. Let's see if Hank can recover. Heal the cooler Let's see if he here. Hank can get it back. Hank's got a mentally. Hank, yeah, Hank cannot lose full here. He had Jake 11, where he wanted 11, him coming 11, back. Four. And here we go. And we're dancing. Wow, just hits the table. Hank, forehand. Oh! oh! What a shot! Wow, we're going to have to get a replay on that one. What Off the shot. edge. What a swing point. Wow, Hank this is the game four. three. This is the game three you need to see. Replay nope. incoming right now. I mean, what a beautiful shot there from Hank. Let's take another look at that. <coughs> Getting it from Jake's POV, and it just hits it. There yeah, we go. He, That's the return from Jake. So it should be this next shot here coming in from Hank. And yeah. Oh, what a beautiful shot. And you know it's a great shot when it hits it and just goes right to the ground. Yeah. Didn't even bounce up. No shot there. And what a, what a key swing point, though. Oh, so we're yeah. looking at 14-12 now. Jake Marsh still two. in the lead. Wow. 13-14. Once again, Lockwood fighting back from an early deficit. Even though Jake has the lead, you got to feel like the momentum is with Hank right now. And and Jake, another unforced error. Hank is on the come up. We got I, I sent I I some I tense. I sent some uh, Jake. Jack, Fours. I sent a little. He, he seems a little tense. 14-14. This is what it all comes down to. Oh, Hank, unforced Hank. error. 4-5. Just getting to that lead is a little bit of a tough spot here for Hank in this game three. And let's see if we can wow, do nice it. Nice shot Jake. there by Jake. Two in a row. 16-14. Jake leading 16-14 in game three. Wow. Serving. I'm just mesmerized right now, Mincy. What a rally. Oh, Great Mincy. rally. 16, Jake 15. Marsh a little bit too long there. A little 16, bit too long 15. there. 
Here we go. Nice. Oh, oh Jake with the return. Oh, Jake. Keeping it alive oh, with the return. Hank, really? What a return by Jake. Oh, Keeping it alive. God. Forcing Hank to hit another slam. Wow. And Hank, the iron un, or the, the net, unkind. I mean, the net has been Hank's friend all series. And right there, it's biting him in the back. And right there, Jake uses the there net. Oh, Thank you. Oh, my God. Keep we got 1815 right now. 1815. Jake 15. Marsh in the lead. Looking to win the series in three games. Miss. Okay. You can cut here the tension go. in the air with the knife oh here at Stoolstream Stadium. 18-16, Jake. This is electric. This is electric. This is what the Stoolies want. This is what we want. This is what everyone wants. Oh, nice oh wow. The net and... is kind to Mr. Oh Lockwood to cut it to a one-point game here. Replay, replay incoming. incoming. We got a replay Hank incoming. Hank's showing some oh, swag. God. He's feeling good about that I one. would say about 90% of the balls that Hank has hit into the net have went in his favor. Hank hits right with topspin, oh, though. I mean, that's kind of part of the top yep. spin thing. You get Absolutely. To get, there yeah. it is. Just beautiful. Nothing All Jake could do. He's laugh. just laughing it off. We didn't see the rage there. He's well, laughing, he's but he's, laughing he's crying. We know he's crying inside. One point lead. Oh, again! Again! No to no tie way! it up! He did it again! We got oh, another replay! Back to back replay. balls off Are the net kidding? to tie it up in game yeah. three! Hank Unbelievable for Lockwood! Hank might have to kick the cooler at every third game because it's working out in his favor right here. We're going to hit another replay. And here wow. we go. Oh, my God. That's the close. Look back at that. To Beautiful. Back to tie it up Beautiful. and down the stretch. 18 all. Wow. Game three. Wow. Oh who, my God, what a who shot. step up. What a shot. 18-18. Oh, oh and Hank, 18, that's not 19. one you can't, you can't lose that one at this point of the game. No, oh, and Hank, and Hank the, oh. net, the net unchined to Hank after. The net giveth, the net taketh. Two game points here for Jake. Jake just being oh, a good member and he wins. It out. Oh, Hank goes long. And Jake says he's the wow. best of the all Look wow. at the emotion from Jake Marsh wow. after the win. And yeah. then the firm handshake Fights. in the arena. Fights back, wow. losing game one. What wow. a great match. What a fantastic I mean, game three. 18, 21, 21, 19, 21, 18. That's Jake incredible. Martin. This continues to be the best rivalry in Stool Stream Stadium. Wow. What a matchup wow. and win for Jake Marsh. What man. a game three. Could you have asked for anything more in that game? Could and you have asked for anything more? seeing the emotion, too, wow. out of both players. You expect that out of Hank, but Jake showed some serious fire here in game three. He did not want to lose that. Right. And, and Congrats and, to Jake pulling that out. And you saw there, right as we're talking about how many beneficial shots Hank used the net for. It bites him in the ass twice in a row. That's unfortunate. And then the last shot just goes a little bit long here. Jake is fired up right now. I mean, he's pacing. I think we're waiting it's on the Roman swipe of the match. So many options to choose from here and what was a spectacular, all three games, really. And you got to give Hank Lockwood both games, two and three, down big comes Roman back. Here's our match. Roman swipe of the match. I believe this is the end. And yep, Hank going yeah. long. Hank going long. The paddle Showing the frustration. Flip. Jake Marsh wow, saying, I'm the best that. in the office. Wow. He crossed See, the love, table. Love seeing Jake Marsh, that kind of passion wow. and fire enthusiasm. He wanted this bad. Look at the energy from Jake. And, and it's just so fascinating how games two and three, Hank down big and both yeah. fought all the way back, had great chances to win both. And, you know, I don't know if Hank's going to even be able to sleep till the next time they play. I mean, I know he's going to – he feels like he let one get away here. Yeah. I mean, that's, that, that's a tough one, but – what an unbelievable third series okay. there. That's just absolutely incredible. I mean, what more could we have wanted there? Is there check the winners? We check hey, Cornhole next Thursday. Can we say who the main event is? Yeah. Next Thursday, we're going to have uh, Dave Portnoy oh, in wow. the mix versus Brianna Chicken Fry, the battle wow. for BFFs. We're also going to have Willie Colon going to make his Cornhole debut, and KFC will be in here. So Do we have any action-packed Thursday next week. No winners. No winners will play no Barstool. Winners. So that means the jackpot will go from 1500 to 2000 next time. I uh, want to thank you know everybody, all our team, Spider, Jake, uh, Hank, Commissioner, who puts this all together. Uh, great you, to have you in here, Mrags, for the first, first time. Just appreciate everybody who makes, up. makes the magic happen at Stool Stream Stadium. It's presented by High Noon Sips next Thursday, Cornhole. Congratulations to Jake Marsh uh, pulling out a thrilling three-game victory over Hank Lockwood. Absolutely incredible. Thank you, Mincy.